sophisticated criminals hitting local businesses could be part of a national ring. Jim Sidlecki has new video of the crooks in this week's burglaries and break in. The last time we saw these two guys, Matt Jekyll's Buffalo Company restaurant was among their targets. My wife was actually wondering if it would be on burglaries and break-ins. Well, Matt, now we're wondering how many more times these guys are going to show up on security cameras without getting caught. You'll remember they use walkie-talkies. You see the one dangling out of his mouth here? They're obviously communicating with someone outside serving as a lookout. You can also see those walkie-talkies in their hands here on this new video police released to us. It's from a burglary at absolutely lowest check advance near 88th and Maple. Just like the other targets, they broke in, cut the alarm cables, and found a small safe that they carried out and across a parking lot. So after making the long walk carrying that heavy safe, the suspects then handed it over the top of this fence, then jumped to the other side and waited a full five minutes. These guys could have played a few games of Angry Birds before their ride showed up. An Omaha police detective working this case tells me he thinks this is a 2012 or 13 Ford Explorer picking the guys up and they're off. They hit four targets that night and could be connected to a string of burglaries as far away as Tennessee. We are certain they're involved in nearly a dozen in Nebraska, so take another look. In Omaha, I'm Jim Seidlecki, Channel 6 News.